everyone. It's great to be back to talk about our strong quarterly performance in the third quarter of 2016. Very strong production performance, another strong performance from a cost perspective. We continue to get good cost performance from all of our operations. As a result, we had solid earnings and very strong cash flow. Because of that uh, solid production performance, we're able to exceed our production guidance for the fifth consecutive year. We should be producing over 1.6 million ounces in 2016. Over many decades, we've learned that given the cyclicality of the gold business, you have to be properly positioned, either for the downside or the upside. In order to do that effectively, you have to think long term. As a result of that, we've got the highest quality, lowest risk growth plan in the business. We're in a strong position to grow our business because we invested in our business over the last five years. We invested in juniors, we increased exploration spending, we bought assets. As a result of that, we have a strong pipeline. We can grow our business and build our production level to over two million ounces by 2020 with assets we currently own. So it was the fact that we think long term, we put capital to work, we put it to work on a measured basis, we manage risk, and all of those things put us in a position where we have a high quality, low risk plan to grow our business. And as we look forward, we've got the unique combination of assets that can grow in regions where we've operated in the past and demonstrated good skills in adding value. We've got a technical skill set that gives us the resiliency to manage the challenges of the gold business. So we're extremely well positioned to deliver high quality growth in a low risk envelope. Quality really means a track record of delivering consistent long-term value for our shareholders, for our employees, and for the communities we operate in. And we've done that effectively over six decades. It's a tough business, and I think what we've demonstrated consistently over the years is that when things get difficult, we have the skills in-house to work our way through those challenges and continue moving the business forward in a way that delivers long-term value for our shareholders. Mm -hmm.